down or synthetic? That's the age old debate that we're going to settle today. We're going to go through some of the key differences between the two types of fill and we're going to outline some common misconceptions about down sleeping bags. One of the common misconceptions about sleeping bag fill is that down is actually better because it's warmer than synthetic fill and that is simply not true. Down is lighter and more compressible than synthetic fill and that's the only difference. It doesn't impact how warm it's going to keep you versus a synthetic fill. Down is also substantially more expensive than a synthetic fill. So the only time you should even be looking at getting a down filled sleeping bag is for those situations where you're concerned about weight. If you're backpacking, if you're doing a canoe portage, if you've got a polk sled and you're transporting things from your vehicle to a location remote in the woods, then down's gonna be the best bet because it's going to be lighter and it's going to compress down smaller when it's stored so it's easier to fit in your backpack. If you're a car camper where you camp and your car is literally parked right over there, do not waste your money on a down bag. Go for the synthetic every time because it doesn't matter how big that bag is or how heavy it is, you're getting it from point A to point B in a car. So save yourself a substantial amount of money and go with the synthetic. Another big misconception about downfilled sleeping bags is that the higher the number of the downfill, the warmer the sleeping bag is. So a lot of people think, for instance, a 20 degree sleeping bag filled with 650 down is less warm than a 20 degree sleeping bag with 950 down. That's completely wrong too. That number you see refers to the fill power. So a 650 fill power versus a 950 fill power. And what that means is that the 650 fill power is going to have more feathers in order to fill up the same amount of space so they don't fluff up as much, which means you need more of them versus the 950 fill power is gonna be a loftier down. And because of that, you're going to need fewer feathers to fill up that sleeping bag because they're gonna loft up and they're gonna trap air because those feathers are bushy. If you have two sleeping bags, both rated to 20 degrees, but with different fill powers, the one with the higher fill power number is going to be lighter, but they're both going to keep you the same degree of warmth at the same temperature. Well, now that we've got everything about sleeping bags all straightened out, it's time for you to pick a tent. And if you're having trouble making a choice, I want you to click right over here. That's gonna take you to my ultimate tent guide and help you pick the best tent for your situation.